Yo, what's up gamers? Welcome to the news broadcast on luck underscore ES channel. Today, new patch, new mission event. You know, there's not that much to say about the patch, but we'll, we'll talk about it while we're going training. Right now, new mission event. You do the missions, you get these rewards and you know, everything else that you usually get. Pretty neat stuff. And on the rolls, we get new skins for the Momo. Ochako and Froppy, as you can see them right here. Here's the Ochako skin, the Momo, and the Froppy. Some Yokatas, some Kimonos, I don't know how to, what to call them. And that's that's about it for the new character role, which is not a new character, just new skins. Because Momo is a free character, you can buy it with tickets if you get enough. Mercy. Regardless, we're here to look at the patch. So let's go over there to the training grounds and look at them, shall we? So here, as you can see, both Alpha 1 and Twice have been nerfed in the damage department. Alpha 1 as well having another, uh, an additional nerf to make it so his alphas knock opponents down way easier. So after a measly three hits of his alpha, or more high, or four at lower levels, they got knocked down into white frames immediately. So it takes four. It takes a whole four alphas to knock people onto the floor. Which is going to make his, you know, usual grabby combo way worse because it's just gonna knock them into white frames upon your first alpha. That is an insane alpha wonder. That is crazy. Basically, what this is going to do is going to make it so your teammates have to be the one to capitalize on your grab combos. Alpha 1 by himself doing grab combos now is going to be terrible unless you do something like this, where you grab them and then swash to a different quirk set where you can do more shots. That's basically how you're going to be having to be playing Alpha 1 now. You actually have to change your quirk set because his default shots now not only do less damage, but also knock opponents to right frames way easier, which is unfortunate for him. Now, I do have to give a shout out to a, another content creator and data miner, Hydro's Place. I would not look into his stuff if you don't want to be spoiled by, you know, future events in the season and whatnot. But he has given us a breakdown on the damage you can do with Alpha 1. As I was saying, shoutouts to Hydro's Place. He has the numbers on his Twitter account that I will display it on screen right now. As you can see, level 1, you do 58 damage with a single Alpha. Do 58 damage at level 2, at level 3 you do 62, so you can see the numbers are accurate. So you can see that before he was doing 74 level 1 and now only doing 58 and all the way up to level 9 he's, done, he's doing 80 instead of 94. And for his held down version he used to do 200 at level 9 and now he's only doing 170 while at level 3 as displayed he does 156. That is it for the AFO changes. Now let's look at twice what happened to him. Twice as much as well as AFO only got a nerf on his alpha he has reduced damage on all levels and reduced ammo on all levels so at level one he used to do 26 for dagger not only does those 24 or those 24 pro dagger level one and he goes up to 32 at level nine now for the amount of daggers he had he has now he only starts with five and goes all the way up to seven well at level 10 he had at level 9, he had 10 daggers. So now he has way less ammunition to spam at people. He has way less to work with. Which is a big hit on twice. But he never needed all 10 of his charges to do insane things anyway. I think twice is going to be fine as because the problem with twice isn't really the daggers. It's more just gamma and how he just tracks to you. You can still do a ton of damage by just pressing the game on you and doing other things. I think twice is going to be fine overall. But yes, that's going to be the end of the patch notes video. Thank you so much for watching and subscribe for more. Bye bye everybody.
I'd like to thank my YouTube members for their support. A very big thank you to Reflected Prince. I'm still a growing channel and any help is very much appreciated. Goodbye everyone.